That was my work. And I'm good at it. But it took me a long time to realize what it cost me. That I can never have a normal life. Whatever normal is. It's family. Kids. That's for other people. Like I chose my path. I've learned how to deal with the things that I've done, but... I never wanted Michael to have to deal with anything like this. It's not about trust. And Sonny and Carly have done everything in your power to protect Michael. And somewhere along the way, he lost the freedom to make mistakes. We learn from our mistakes, Jason. You tell a young child not to put his hand on a fire, and it's not until he puts his hand in the flames does he finally get it. You guys never let Michael get burned. Sam. He was kidnapped, he was shot. Yes, I know, but he's only ever paid for other people's mistakes. He doesn't have a clue about consequences. No one's ever taught Michael the power of making the right choice. People figure out who stands where when he hits the fan. That, that, that's all I'm talking about. Okay. All right, good. Mario, hey, do you know, is, is Jason here? I just thought of my shit. Actually, Jason Morgan, he's not here right now. Can I, can I help you with something? No, I will leave him a message on his answering machine. Oh, in the meantime, how about I uh, buy an espresso? This place is famous for its cannolis. Two cannoli, two espresso, please. <laughs> that's sweaty. If you're hitting on me, don't bother. <laughs> I don't know. I'm much smoother when I'm in on something. I mean, I could if you want me to. No, thanks. <laughs> Wait, you're, you're the you're the one who brought Carly into the ER after her ordeal, right? Yes, I am, and I told the cops everything I know. Well, I know, but this is me. You have any idea what happened to Claudia? Why would you want to know? Look, you know who I am. There's going to be a lot of trouble here. I'm just trying to keep a lid on things. Claudia's disappeared, the natives are getting restless. Sonny has me and the rest of his men on high alert. Okay, well, I'll tell you exactly what I told the cops. I went to the cabin, Carly was giving her birth. All I was worried about was getting her and the baby to the hospital. No sign of Claudia? No, I mean, no, no sign of Claudia. For all I know, she was in the car, crawled out, died in the woods somewhere, or who knows, maybe she had someone help her escape. Either way, I don't care. Anything else? Yeah, I still think you should try the kill away. Cute. Not that cute. I asked Jax to leave today. Whatever, I can't get... can't think about that right now. I have to focus on Michael, so we gotta... We have to go to Sonny's house and we have to bring him back here. I agree. I think he should be here, too. What about the police? We could tell them where Claudia's body's buried. I could tell them. I mean, I know the cabin is burned and there's no evidence, but, you know, an autopsy would support what happened. We could tell them everything. We could talk to a lawyer, figure out what Michael should plead. Should he, should he plead involuntary manslaughter or self-defense? I mean, even if we can get him a suspended sentence or community service, this kid is going to be known as the kid who killed his stepmother. Oh, God. We're never going to be able to keep this quiet. I know. 
and the media will have a field day. I'll be known as the mobster son that got away with murder. They'll camp out at the courthouse on the front lawn. I can handle that, but I can't put my kids through that. Jason, I don't want Michael to get sucked up in Sonny's world. We have to go get him and we have to bring him home. Jason, I was wondering uh, if we could talk. Do you have a minute? I want you to understand that uh, I fully intended to tell Carly about Claudia as soon as the baby was born, but Sonny beat me to it. Yeah, well, I don't think Sonny knew that Carly was in the room when he unloaded on Claudia. Well, it doesn't really matter now. The truth is out. Carly decided that I put Michael in danger. When the truth is, I was trying to protect her and the baby. Now that's one way to look at it. Well, your hands aren't exactly clean in this either. I mean, you kept almost as many secrets as I. I only suspected what you knew for sure. All right, okay. We both want what's best for Carly, though, right? That would mean Carly with me, and Michael and Morgan and our little girl, at, together as a family. That's, that's up to Carly. Yeah, I know. But look, you, you know her better than anyone, Jason, okay? What do you think she wants? I think she wants to be able to trust you. Do you really think with everything that's going on in her life, she needs a marriage to fall apart? I mean, be the friend that you say you are. Talk her down, okay? She doesn't want this breakup any more than I do.